Hello everybody, this is Francisco Martinez for um, MUX, uh, Mobile User Experience 1. And this is week 3's project, um, as well as the analysis from everything I went through. Um, first of all, let me just start by saying that um, things are getting better with this. i um, adding some things. Um, the app does look a little different, uh, as you can see from here. Well, not from here, but from here, I decided to add some pictures. Um, obviously, it still needs some work, but um, it seems to be going really well. Um, same, it, at, well, another thing you couldn't understand is that the app is actually working. Last time, it wasn't working, so I was able to actually get it to work to make sure that everything was fine. I literally had to start with scratch in order to do it, but... Um, it seems to have worked well, so that's that's all I can say. Um, I had an issue with the survey as far as trying to show people the survey. Um, this is survey two, but with survey one, I had it. Well, no, I'm sorry. Well, yeah, with survey one, I, I had an issue because um, I was able to get like it was kind of tough for me to actually make sure that the the survey was would show up. Um, with survey two. It was a much worse issue being that it wouldn't even really reload the page. Um, I actually did have the link that allowed me to reload, but for some reason it was going back instead of just reloading. So I decided to just take the whole thing off and see if I could work on it. Um, but um, I couldn't really do that in time. It, it was just something that was... It was just a mess when it came to that. Um, but I was able to get some feedback from it, which I felt was very, very necessary. Um... One of the things that I actually did not add, which I added right now, was the section that allowed me to discuss what markers were. Um, one of the questions that I asked people were was to look for a marker, um, a certain kind of marker, whether it was a MagFed or a company marker, which was like maybe Tipman or something like that. Um, some of them didn't really understand exactly what the, what I was talking about as far as finding a marker. Um, I was only able to once again get two people to actually help me with this. So um, they were able to f they were able to actually like find out what they were looking for, but it, it took them a while. Um, it didn't have anything to do with navigation as far as navigating through the app. It was more like trying to give more information than what I was actually giving them. So if I wanted to give them a mag, if I wanted to ask for a mag fed marker, which is one of these, I w they would have actually went and actually go to the marker section and look for a mag fed marker, which is one of these. And it says mag fed here. The problem is, is that, like I said, it was actually hard for them to actually like find one that would say mag fed, mostly because I did not edit these. Now, this would say woods ball, this would say speed ball, and this would say mag fed. So... Um, I had to make sure I edited it. I gotta edit it a little bit better as far as um, the information that's needed, which is another thing that they really wanted was more information about everything else. Um, maybe history, um, especially with the rules. Um, I tried my best to actually figure out what what kind of rules I should put up. I don't even know if I should put up any game type rules or anything like that. I just wanted to make sure that they knew like the basic of the game. So, but they wanted to know more about it as far as rules from other games, uh, other game types and things like that. Um, they really like the map. Like me, just like they're able to open it up and see this, see where there's like different locations as far as um, a paintball shop or a paintball field, that kind of thing. They were really into that. They really enjoyed that. Um, they it, they felt like this was definitely one of the highlights of the of the actual app. Um, they were very impressed by that. Um, as for the actual section with the markers, while there wasn't enough information about it, they at least knew there were different types of markers out there for them to pick up. Um, <coughs> and with this, they were able to find out like the difference between what a woods ball marker is compared to a speed ball marker and compared to a mag fed marker, as well as the name marker itself being changed from paintball guns. So they were able to actually get that going with no problem. 
Um, so their feedback was definitely necessary. I really needed that. Um, I hope to well be when the week is over when the program is over i'm hoping that i can actually get this to look a little bit more better add as much information as possible because now that i know that the basic function of the app is working as far as like navigation goes and as far as making sure like all these links work as long as those work i can actually go in and put in more information and make it seem like it's a much more useful app so that's what I'm hoping for as far as the coming week goes, um, especially before whatever we have to actually do for it. Um, I believe we're going to be submitting it in some way, um, maybe uh, actually distributing it, maybe. Um, I, I read it somewhere. I didn't really um, dive too deep into it. But either way, um, that's another thing. I'm going to make sure that the survey, I'm going to make sure that it does reload. I'm going to make sure that it does stop, just like how um, past assignments were in another class. I'm going to make sure that all that works. Um, it was a slight bug, and it was kind of a pain, but like I said, it's something that is it's not like I can't handle that. I'm, I'm, going to pretty, I'm pretty sure that I can, I'm going to be able to handle it with no problem. Um, other than that, yeah, I hope you guys were able to go through this week with no problem. Um... It seems like pretty. It seems like this class is pretty decent. It's not like I said. It's not bad. Um, I just I like the fact that we're able to combine certain things as far as um, creating an app and using um, our technical writing skills to actually um, produce something that allows us to um, distribute it when the time comes to distribute it. Um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to the last week. Hopefully, um, things start to get better as far as my app goes. I really can't wait for it to be at its starting point because that's how I feel. It's actually at its start starting point before I can actually go in and put even more features. So um, yeah, uh, I hope you guys, like I said, are doing better than I am. I uh, wish you luck and have a good night.